Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and level up using the souls we got from defeating Ranala. Uh, I'm gonna pump my one single level into faith because we still don't have what we need to uh, wield that cool magma sword we got from uh, Makar. Uh, whatever his name is. Uh, the big magma worm dragon guy we killed. Let me see how far off we are. Uh, 18 and I'm at 14, so just four more levels. And we'll finally be able to test that out. But for now, uh, we actually have uh, two stops to make at the uh, the round table. Actually, I don't remember what it's called, but the uh, the the like main hub area. The uh, yeah, round table hold. I knew it was something something about the round table because there's literally a round table in the middle. Uh, but we'll have to uh, speak to uh, Sir Gideon the Giga Chad to see where we're going next. And of course, I want to see what I can transpose the uh the boss soul to what oh goodness okay uh okay 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 so far so good but i'm not gonna i'm not gonna just assume that i'm about to win just because uh oh my god my dude has dark beads <laughs> okay i was able to win is that why it's like all dark and there's no one here? Are they gonna like okay, so it's it's gonna take me to the real one, right? Twin maiden husk. Clinging bones. That's interesting. So there's like a you try to go back to the like the hub and there's like a an invader, like a PvP fight to do. Okay, so Sir Gideon is not in his usual spot. Interesting. I wonder if that has anything to do with the progress I've made. For now, I can go talk to Transposition Lady. Hello, uh, Ludwig. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, two great runes. Yeah. Fine work, Brave Tarnished. The greater will is pleased. Thank you, disgusting fingers. Okay. Audience with Queen Merica. Yeah, okay. Restore the golden order. Is that going to bring... Peace to the the lands between. Fingers expect. As much from me as they did young Gideon. Okay, a token of farewell? From him or from you? Talisman pouch. Okay. Well, actually, I... Actually, I wanted to talk to you about something else. <laughs> yeah. Receive power from remembrance. Yes, okay. Yeah, so as I expected, it can be turned into boosts full moon sorcery. Either okay, so this was the uh, the spell she used, where she like furls into a ball and literally like launches a moon at you. Which there's no way on God's green earth I'm ever going to be able to use because look at that int requirement. My God. Um. Yeah, it was seven. <laughs> I would need to do ten times level up, but this. I mean, it's still got a 60 int requirement. I'm nowhere near able to use it. Uh, uh, the Carrion Regal Scepter, a Glintstone Staff. But I would kind of like it. I'm never going to be able to use it, but I mean, I have the Remembrance. If I was a, uh, a spellcaster, I'd probably want Renala's Full Moon. But just for collection purposes, I'll do the Carrion Regal Scepter. Okay. Uh, receive equipment of champions? Oh! Oh, okay, so you when you beat a boss, she's also Domnal from uh, from Dark Souls 1. I'm not sure where you buy boss equipment from, from other games. I know there's multiple vendors that sell boss armor in Dark Souls 2, and then in Dark Souls 3. I think you just get it from the, uh, the old lady at the at Firelink Shrine. But she is the boss transposition lady, and she's where you get the armor of uh, bosses you've beaten. So uh, when I start doing challenge runs for this game, where I start dressing up like bosses and trying to beat the game as said bosses, me and this uh, this uh, finger reader, in en Enya, Enya, sure, uh, we are going to become very well acquainted. For now, I gotta go find Gideon. Uh, I'll cut back to when I have located young Master Gigachad.
Okay. So, uh, I haven't found... Oh, no, I have found Gideon. Okay. I thought this might be Gideon because I, I looked up where to find him and it said that he can be found in his office. I didn't want to look too far, uh, just in case of spoilers, but I saw books. Uh, also, there was, like, a guy, a weird-looking knight, standing outside of this door. And now he's... I guess he's dead because I just picked up his entire armor set. Uh, I, I probably won't be wearing it, but I do kind of want to see what it looks like. There's the, the helmet I got for killing that crab. Um, let us, let us check out the, uh, the drip. Um, okay, that's really cool. I, would you, would you guys not like it if I wore, oh, okay, you know what, never mind. I think I'm heavy rolling. Doesn't seem that bad in this game, though. It still seems like, it's nowhere near as bad as it is in Dark Souls 1. I'm doing, like, I have to wear Havel's ring, uh, during my Smo run just so that I don't, like, end my own life. Uh, what is the equip load? So I'm just shy. I have a heavy load there. So if I go back to my original armor, let's see, um, champion, and I believe it's champion gators. It's still medium load. I mean, of course, you know, Godric's axe is massive. Uh, I talked to the blacksmith. Um, it turns out I don't have the, uh, upgrade material I need to level up this bad boy. So I guess I'll just have to keep searching for that. Um... And then I uh, I talked to that chick who always wants to hug you, and she hugged me. It was great. Um, okay, hey, you're the you're the lady that helped me defeat Godric. Maybe you killed the the night guy, Nephli Lu, Nephli Lu. Found it in Godric's grafting grounds. You've defeated him. You should have it. Make a use of it. Yeah, I gotcha. Arsenal charm. So I just got a talisman thing. Is it, is this? What is this? Raises vitality. Oh yeah. Okay. So this is where that is. Maximum equip load. <laughs> Look at that. We were just talking about equip load. Hang on. That's pretty epic, my guy. So what am I now? Okay. It didn't help at all. I'm still medium load. Um. Wow. Yeah. I'm, I was. I'm. I'm a little shocked. This actually feels like light rolling. Um. With how fast it is. I'm. I'm kind of. That's kind of wild. Um, okay, Mr. Gideon the Gigachad. Yes. Yes, I have. I'm a knight of the round table now. The Gideon Ofnir. It's tarnished who wishes to stand before the Elden Ring and become Elden Lord. I am accumulating knowledge to be all-knowing. Yeah, I heard about you in the opening cutscene. Uh, select group of fellows. As such, I ask that you remain constant. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll try. Um. You'll be after more great runes now. Uh, yeah, yeah. Um. I was told that you could point me in the direction of where I'm supposed to go. Shard bearers, yeah. So, like, the last lady wasn't a demigod, but she was a shard bearer. Five of them, including you, the ones you defeated. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Gotrick. I loved that boss fight. General Radon. Yeah, I've heard that he is very tough. Uh, Praetor Rykard. Okay. I think I've seen a picture of him. He's like a big wormy boy. Morgoth, the grace given. I've heard that he, he, she, whoever, is pretty tough. Uh, Ranala. Yeah, just took care of her. Uh, okay. Who's Ensha? My apologies for that. Ensha got rather ahead of himself if has a But now Oh, was Ensha the guy <laughs> Oops. Yeah, I guess Ensha was the guy I just fought. Uh I guess he heard that I was gonna become an uh not an Elden Lord, but a member of the the round table, and he was like, I must test him by trying to kill him, trying to kill our new recruit. It's not about Gotrick. Damn. Limgraves Northwest, yeah. I do, because I murdered him. Um, I'm going to save him for later, because I, if, it's my understanding that he's a big, tough boy. It's like Cosmic Beast Radon or something like that. I, I've, you know, tried to avoid spoilers, but I have seen some stuff here and there. I know he's like, <laughs> he's square, but I, I mean, I know that from the opening cutscene when he fought Millennia. Uh, let's do... 
Renala, since I've also already defeated her. Yeah, the the Lake of Lyrnia. Or Lyrnia of the Lake, actually. Govern the Okay, so uh, that's why there's so many uh Carrion knights around Oh Radigan. Okay, so Radigan used to be with her and then left her for Merica? Is is that is that right? Let me run through that one more time. Uh yeah. Uh Queen of Carrion, that's why there are so many Carrion knights around, like Bowles and uh, you know, the others I, that I fought. Uh the guy that kicked my ass so many times with parrying. Okay, so he doesn't go back over the part with Radigan, but the rune was a gift from Radigan, apparently. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna go after Rykard. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go after Rykard. I don't know if I'm gonna go after Radon next or Morgoth, but I think I'm gonna go Rykard, Morgoth, and then Radon. So let's learn about Rykard. Hey, Volcano Manor. That's a. Uh, that's where I have to go to get my Chaos Blades. You know, quote unquote. Uh, I still remember. I'm still trying to complete the build, even though I have this sick axe. Volcano Mount Gelmir lies west of the Altus Plateau, the realm of the Aird Tree. Okay. It was the stage of the most appalling battle in the entirety of the Shattering. Okay, so this is like the Battle of Seki Gahara. Uh, grave sin of blasphemy, marking himself as an enemy, never to be forgiven. Yeah, blasphemy is probably one of the worst sins there is. Um, okay, let's learn about Morgoth since I intend to fight him before... The capital city. Maybe I should save him for the end. Lies at the foot of the air tree in the east of the Altus Plateau. Forbids us from venturing there. Okay, so I wouldn't even... Yeah, okay, so it sounds like I'll have to beat Radon, and then that opens up his area, Morgoth's area. The Veiled Monarch can wait. Okay, so that means Radon. The famed Red Lion and Scourge of the Stars. That's what it is, not Cosmic Beast. Scourge of the Stars. Ferocious worry fought millennia and her rot uh, to a standstill in the Kalid wilds. Yeah, Kalid has been engulfed by the scarlet rot. Oh, I know where this area is. This is actually directly to the right of the starting area because I've I've actually seen a couple of memes starving off the rot with fire. Uh, I've seen a couple of memes where people are like, um, uh, you know what would be good game design if we literally just put hell right next to the starting area. <laughs> Uh, I've also seen, because I remember I looked at a couple of uh, guides, like, um, oh, what's a good way to start the game for, like, a good a good start? Uh, and a lot of people were like, if you're a sorcerer, you can go right over to, like, a mid-to-end game level area and get, get, like, a good sorcery or some good sorceries. Uh, whatever. Uh, regardless, um, we've learned a lot of interesting information. Uh... And I think we're going to start making our way to Rykard. Okay, after giving it some thought and uh, uh, consulting the the many storied tarnished before me, I think I'm going to go after uh, Rad 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 Radon? Rad the, the, the Scourge of the Stars, that guy. Um, the guy who like fought millennia to a, a, not a standstill, but I mean, he gave her a good fight. Um, so I guess I'll do that now, um, but I think before I head there, I think, um, uh, that his area is to the right of the starting area, Limgrave, but I think before I head there, I have been advised to head to an area, see if I can, oh, oh, I've actually been to Khalid before, I guess this is the area I farm for my souls, or maybe it's something else, I'm not sure. Um, regardless, I think before I head over there, uh, I'm going to head back to Limgrave and, uh, try to find a, a place called, uh, I think it was called Siofra River. A lot of people have advised that I, uh, give Siofra River a look before I start trying to make my way to the next, uh, Shardbearer. So, um, I guess I'll just fast travel to the first steps.
Oh, you know what? We could give the Tree Sentinel a try since we're here. Um, we're a little bit stronger. We're a little bit taller. We're ballers. We have girls that look good, and we should call her. Yeah, I think I'll give it a shot. I mean, no sense in not trying. I don't stand to lose much, I don't think. I have like 20,000 souls, but I can get that back pretty easily. Standard fare. Okay. It's more respectable than when I first started, that's for sure. Um, just R1 spam. I think that's a decent strategy for now. I got him in a nice little rock area where it's kind of hard for him to hit me. He's getting staggered by the pups. Oh, I probably should have rolled instead of jumping, but wow, yeah, I'm doing way better now. Um, it is significantly easier to do a lot of damage to him, and I still have two wolves, just barely, though. Um, and his pattern is still pretty... Oh, wait. Ah, rolled right into that one, I think. Um, it's still pretty easy to remember. I want to try to do some pretty decent damage before that happens, before he kills my wolves. Yeah, he's gonna come down with the big boy. I got it. Um, I still don't have it 100%, but, I mean, odds are looking much better than they did before. Uh, I think it's reasonable to say I can probably... Ugh, I'm not trying to poise tank, dude. Come on. Um, I think I might be able to... Ah, uh, maybe... No, that was a bit of a pipe dream there. Uh, roll towards him, and... I think that's fine. Oh, nope. <laughs> I saw him go for a jump, but I'm nowhere near as tense as I was before. Yeah, I think it just killed him. Wow, look at that. En enemy felled. Wow. I think that was quite po- Oh, the golden halberd. I got his weapon. I think that might have been one of the most rewarding wins that I have earned so far. Also, I just realized all the... I know this is... For, I've seen a couple of, like, paintings in-game of Merica on this, like... She's, like, tied or, like, like, like bonded to the Elden Ring. It's fucked up. <laughs> it's fucked up that they... I don't know if they did it to themselves or if somebody did it to them, but it's fucked up. Um, alright, I guess I... It's really awesome that I earned that. Um, kind of feeling myself right now. Uh, I guess I'll, uh... I guess I'll go snag... What, what is this? Real quick before I read message. Yeah, yeah, fuck yourself. Uh, <laughs> okay, I guess I'm off to try to figure out where uh, Lyurnia... Or not Lyurnia of the lake, uh, where uh, Sofra or Siofra Lake... Or Siofra River. I guess I'm off to find out where that is. Oh my god. Uh, I don't want to fuck with him. Is this, like, a thing? Pick up item? Oh, thank god, I found the map. Dog, I, uh... I've been wanting to find this map. Okay. Let's see. So what I'm looking for is right there. Okay. <laughs> now I know exactly where it is. And you know what? Since I do, I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Oh, he don't give a fuck. Okay, hang on. Oh, no, he does. Oh, god. Oh god, he, yeah, he certainly does. It's like a grizzly bear mixed with a honey badger. Oh god, I can hear him pounding towards me! Oh god, that that definitely freaked me out. Okay, wow, I hit the... Oh, okay, I'll see you later, dude, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I, like, offended you or bothered you or was just a general pain in the ass. You were really cool to, like, not just swat the shit out of me and knock my head off my shoulders as soon as you saw me. Um... Yeah, I'm just not fucking with that. Uh, I have, like, a, a bunch of souls, but I'm just shy of leveling up. So... Wow, this is... This is fucking forever. Uh, yes, uh, to expand on what I was saying earlier, I have been advised by, uh, uh, the Tarnished before me that it would behoove me to check out the entire underworld area... Uh, that is underneath, like, Limgrave and basically the whole map. There's, there's like, two maps layered on top of each other. There's an entire overworld, and there is apparently an entire world underground. So, uh, I've decided, uh, as well as, like, looking up websites, you know, I'm, I'm always trying to avoid spoilers so I can 
keep a fresh reaction, but this is exactly the place that I saw. I think I looked up like a game spot uh, walkthrough just to find out where exactly this place was. And lo and behold, I do believe I have found what I was looking for. Uh, I think there's there's some kind of item over here. I thought I saw something. Uh, well, it doesn't matter. We're gonna we're gonna head on into Siofa River and see what we can find. Also, this is apparently a place where I can summon my little beaches. So, okay, I found my first enemies. I've just been picking up some golden runes so far. Um, do you want to fight? Is that what's going on here? I can, like, back off if that's what you want. But are you, like, trying to fight? Because, I mean, I, I will fight you. What are you thinking? Oh, yeah, he wants to fight. What the hell? Sloppy ass. Cringe ass. No, no. Dude, you, you do not have the poise to tank me. Stop playing. Here we go. Uh, uh. Oh no, there's a couple of them. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. There it is. Okay. Okay. I'm starting to understand. Uh, they're slow, but do not give them the time to gang up on you like I did. I just, I wasn't sure if they were hostile or not. I thought he was maybe coming to check me out, but this is a Soulsborne game, so I guess I should have known better. <laughs> All right. Let's give it our our best shot again. I'm not going to let him hit me with that, but I am going to hit him and then try to back off. Yeah, there we go. Hit, hit, and then try to back off. Okay, that one clipped me. So I can stagger him with two... Okay, 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 okay. Relax, relax. So I can stagger him with two heavy attacks, but that's real slow. I have to spin and then spin again, so... I definitely gotta... Okay, alright, alright, here they go. They're gonna try to gang up on me. Which, you know, I can't fault them for, honestly, because I did just, in fact, gang up on them, so... You know, kind of all's fair situation. Um, what is this stuff on the ground? Nope. Oink. I see a, th a third one, or fourth one, whatever. I see another one coming up behind me. I guess I can't hit them from behind. It would be a little broken because they're kind of slow. You could literally just walk up behind them and then kill them. Okay, that seems to be the main force down, but it did cost me my puppers. So, yeah, I got four smithing stones. Wow, thanks. Oh, I think they melt into this shit. Interesting. Um, let's check this out before moving forward. Uh, can I summon my horse? Yes, I can. What is this? Acquire material. A golden centipede. I'm not sure what that does, but... It doesn't... There's an item up there, but it doesn't appear that I can get up that way, so... I will just have to make do... Going this way. And there are a couple of items and some more bad guys. Okay. Uh-oh. There's a, a apparently a spellcaster of some kind involved. I'm just going to attack once and then roll back. Attack once. Oh, okay. I got to be careful with my timing for my attack once and roll back strategy. Um, golly gee willikers. I sure hope these guys don't murder me with their massive bomb attack. I want to try the, uh, no, I feel like that's a little too risky trying, I was going to say try the, uh, I command the kneel attack. I'm already in a bit of a risky situation with, ugh, fighting a bunch of them. I think I just killed one. Ugh, come on. Oh, jeez. All right. Relax. Okay, there's another one dead. Hopefully you'll be joining your friends soon. Oh gosh, oh gosh, okay. I don't know what happens here, but oh yeah, I knew it couldn't be good. Because he got me in, in a double grab attack. I gotta watch out for that thing. It moves slow, but it's very obstructive. 
Nope. Oh, okay, you can backstab these things. I must have just gotten the placement wrong. Come here. Okay. Placement timing something. So it does take a couple hits to stagger them, but there it goes. Now I gotta go fight the sorcerer guy. Let me try to get him over get over here, grab this guy before he busts out another thing. No, that ain't gonna fly. There we go. And it does some mighty fine damage indeed. So what do these guys have on them? Silver fly and a silver fly. I just fought like a dozen fairly tough enemies for like some garbage. Alright. Well, I'm getting lots of like runes to the side, so I can't be too upset. You and me, let's go. No. 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 Okay, these guys are significantly not as strong. I think the main deal with them is just, um... Being general assholes. Oh god, I can't believe he actually hit me with that. I am having a hard time figuring out where their ass is. <laughs> can't tell they're ahead from their ass. Just one guy over here. Hopefully it's not some kind of trap. It is, I just saw people moving. Lame. Let me... Let me have good stuff, come on. I have one flask left, and there's like... Oh my god, there's like 20 guys. I'm not fighting them all. I'm just gonna wait for them to come over here. And then I'm just gonna walk up behind them. Really, really slowly. And, uh... Nab all their shit. Now run! Okay, here we go. Here we go. Run, 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 run. Okay, one. Two. I get it? Nope. Smithing stones, what the hell? And then this door's locked, so it doesn't do anything. Alright guys, well, it's been nice. Uh, I don't appreciate the uh, attempt at an ambush. Luring me in with uh, shiny pearlies. But, um... I think I'm just gonna keep moving forward. And then, if I, if I die later on... Well then, at least I, I died in a fair, upright challenge instead of somebody, again, trying to ambush me. Alright, here we go. I, I believe we're going up. So, is this the surface world, or... No, it doesn't appear to be. Well, maybe it is, because that's the night sky, but... I feel like I could see the night sky from down there as well, yeah. This is so strange. It's like an underworld, but there are some places where you can still see the sky. Worried about a guy around the corner? No? Okay. This is just good job for uh, preserving bolluses. This is just a, a good job for looking around kind of deal, I guess. Um, considering busting out torrent. Oh, another good job for looking around, I guess. Beast liver. Giving me a lot of giving a, a lot of crafting materials to somebody who doesn't craft. Oh god, I didn't know the mosquito attacked you. Oh I, I, I thought it was friendly. Please don't spit on me, Mr. Krabs. I remember you from uh not a not SpongeBob. Um oh god, uh, Dark Souls 3. Um Oh, uh, you remember me? I was the guy that, um, killed all your children. Uh, run. <laughs> really? Where's a, where's a grace when you need one, man? Come on. See that item? Should I risk going back for it? Will that be a fool's errand? Actually, that's not even an item. That's a plant. Fuck you. <laughs> I'm glad I did a... Cost benefit analysis before I just went brazenly charging in and getting smashed. It's just plants that that trick you into thinking they're items. Fucking plants. <gasps> oh I knew it! I knew it! I knew there was gonna be a grace around here somewhere because uh this game is fantastic about not making you retread uh, your old tracks. How close am I to a level up? Oh god, I'm right there. I bet if I 
crunched on some runes right now, I could do it. Heck yeah, I got enough for a level up. Going to level 64, putting it into faith. One down, three to go, and then I can use my uh, my magma worm sword. All right, let's uh, let's delve a little further and um, see what's going on here. Uh, so this is interesting. There seems to be a lot of different places to go, uh, and in that, I am grateful for. I guess I'll light this. I don't know. Maybe it's a reverse version of the Abyss Watchers. When you light all three of those things, you uh, you get to fight the next boss. Um, but. I think I'll explore around, and I do like the fact that you can just fast travel back and be like, oh, yeah, I actually wanted to, um... What? Oh, no, 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 I actually... I'm actually friendly, you don't... Um... <laughs> well, you see, the funny thing about that is, uh, I'm not gonna fight you guys. But if you want to fight me, then that is certainly your prerogative. I think I'm just gonna check out whatever is at the top of this hill. I think I'm just gonna do that instead. Uh, okay, Ar Artificia Leaves, Inverted Hawk Heater Shield. I'm not going to use any of this stuff, but I do want to try to collect as many goodies as possible, just in the event that I do end up, you know, trying to mix it up. Hey, dude, I guess I have... Oh, oh okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was going to make a joke about maybe offending him by passing by, but <laughs> then he squared up, and I was like, y you know, I, I don't think jokes are very appropriate. Oh, I got the the map for the area. Nice. I don't think I should be checking this out right now. I don't know where he's at. Okay. Um, Very spicy. What the heck? I don't have the map for this area, but that's fine. Whatever. Uh, I guess I'll just explore a little bit, see what's... uh. The Hollow Horn Grounds. I'm a little afraid of walking up to that guy because that reeks of like open world boss. Let me check my uh, check my business. Actually, is that a corpse? Oh no! Wait, no! 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 Tell me, it doesn't. It doesn't come back to life and fight you here, does it? Because I, I I find it very hard to believe that uh, this is just an empty area for lore or something. I don't know. Now that I think about it, maybe it's not a great place for a boss fight, but I suspect maybe maybe this is the boss where if you light all of those things, he'll uh, he'll put on the mask like Eustace Bags and he'll go ooga booga 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 and then kill you seventy times. All right, well uh, I guess I'll fuck off because uh, I I can't see a point to being here. All right, heading on forward. I'm gonna actually head past this jumpy point here. Lots of, um, forest fellas. I don't know how strong they are, but I mean, they look strong. And I, I mean, I got a horse. I have a horse and they don't. So, yeah, I might just ride on by and see what secrets they're holding. Oh, it's a light thing. Um, let me light that before I get my brains removed from my head. And then hop back on my horse while walking, because that's a thing I can do in this game, and uh, just uh, skitter-scatter on out of the way. Man, there are a lot of big, hairy forest men. Not complaining, I'm just saying there's a lot of them here. <laughs> okay, this is the third light the thing in the thing, and there's like a... Oh god, there's a, there's a lightning bolt monster. It's actually kind of cool. It's like some kind of trap. Um, okay, well, it didn't really... Oh, there's another one. I'm just running around lighting random fires. I'm not even sure if this is doing anything, but, I mean... This is a Soulsborne game. Lighting and extinguishing fires, you know, that, that means something. It's, like, special. God, look at them. So majestic in their natural environment comes over and smashes my teeth in. I'm like, oh, so Another Lost Grace. Man, I love this game. I love this game because it has so many more ch checkpoints than normal Dark Souls. Uh, I'm not sure how much longer I want to go on for, but maybe we'll just explore a little more of this area, and then we'll... Okay, just random 400 souls. you would love to see it. Um, look at that. What the f Fuck. That, what the fuck? That's so pretty. 
get like a screenshot there. <laughs> um, well, yeah, I guess that adds up because this is where the... I mean, I don't know any of the bosses in this area. I literally only found out about this area today, so I have not heard anything about it. I was pretty good for spoilers when it came to this, apparently. But, um... I mean, I know the next guy I'm gonna fight is... Ra not not Radigan, but R Radon. Uh, the general, general Radon. And uh, he is definitely a stud. Um... He's a very powerful boss, from what I hear, and, uh, I mean, he's the, um, not the god of war, but, I mean, he's, like, um, he's the scourge of the stars, and you know what? That looks like a lot of stars to me. Uh, I don't like going through these things. They always lead you to fuck all. No, no, I'm fine. Oh, there's another light area. I'm gonna go ahead and light a yink. Hello, hello. Bo like, oh, Dark Souls rats. Oh my gosh. Hello, guys. It's been a while. How'd you guys survive, um... I mean, <laughs> whatever the fuck happened in Dark Souls 3. <laughs> that old fucking thing. Um, yeah, there they are. Wow, guys. It's, uh, it's been a while. Wow. Wow. Sliver of meat. Sliver of fucking meat. Meet this, meet that. Meet these nuts in your mouth. <laughs> Man! Another fucking grace! I guess this is for people who are actually fighting their way through those guys. I imagine that would actually be useful. You know, if I was actually fighting anything. <laughs> Instead of just running away. Also, it's good for exploration, you know. At the very least, uh, I can come back and check out that portal sometime. Maybe you guys can tell me whether or not it is actually fucking worth it. Okay, well, I guess we... Is this an elevator? It, it do, in fact, do be, do be do. Do be looking like an elevator. What's this fella? Yeah, I'll use the stone sword key thing. Two? What was that for? Ugh. Sons of bitches. Um, alright, well, I guess I'm gonna... Maybe this wouldn't have worked without the stone sword keys. Who knows? I'll, I'll never know. I guess we're going up to fucking Olympus now. Hey, look, uh, this guy, he knows Olympus. Yeah, he does. Um, I'm thinking about cutting it off here. We've been going for almost an hour at this point. Uh, I'll make sure to cut out a ton of stuff, and then I'll, I'll... What I'll do is I'll cut out a bunch of stuff. And then I'll reference those jokes or discussions... And then you guys will have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about, because, uh, oh. Uh-oh. Uh, because, um, <laughs> because, uh, because I cut it all out. Uh, we're in, we're in DJ Khaled now. Yeah, the sky is red and everything is fucked. Um, I guess that's it for Sof Sofia River. I could have sworn I heard or saw something that they're like there was a boss down there. Maybe I missed it. I'll go back. I'll do some research. Um, but I, I don't know if I'm ready to throw myself at Radon yet. I mean, he's a he's a fucking square, guys. <laughs> I'm de I forgot to mention to you guys. Uh, I am definitely afraid of squares. So we'll just have to we'll just have to see how things go. Won't we now. All right, well, uh, I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Um, by the time you guys get the next one, this one should be going up tomorrow, as of me saying this. But uh, the next one you guys get for Elden Ring should be after the Smo Dark Souls run is done. So get hyped for that. Uh, and I guess I'll see you guys in that one. Peace.